Hi chums, welcome to notagamble.com and today we're going to have a quick look at the play all night roulette system. <clears throat> now this is a sister system for the progressive dozens, uses very much the same staking pattern. So if you've seen that particular video, uh, then you'll recognize this system. If not, feel free to go over and, and check out the progressive dozens video and um, we're going to go through a sample session today but if you want to know all the details of the system uh, including the, the staking levels bankroll etc etc then head over to notagamble.com uh, we've got a free members area there where you can download all our videos and all our fact sheets about each of these individual systems okay um, obviously if you like the video then choose like to subscribe ring the bell um, and leave comments below and of course tell your friends okay so let's get going Snodagamble.com. Right, so welcome back. So um, you can see on screen that we're playing with a simulator for this this particular session, just to allow us to zip through the spins. Um, and you can also see that we're on a single zero table. Now it does make quite a difference on this particular system whether you're on a single zero or a double zero. As we know, the house edge increases on on a double zero. Now um, this particular system, if we go to level four, uh, level fourteen, sorry, uh, we would expect to to be able to play for about 740 odd spins and now that comes down to 600 and odd when we are using a double zero so it does make quite a big difference so we'd very much suggest that you use a single zero if you can now we know that's not always possible if you're in the US plane in a uh, in a bricks and mortar casino then obviously you have to play the table that's there uh, but if you've got the choice go for a zero um, now I should say before we get going that if you like the video then choose a like button choose subscribe ring the bell, uh, leave any comments, um, and uh, if you want to tell your friends, then of course, please do. So, uh, this particular system is based on two factors, really. One is a slow progression. Uh, so, it is uh, very much the same progression system as our, our progressive dozens, but also this works on the basis that your trend is your friend. So, the result of one spin can influence another, or more precisely, that there are natural patterns that come out when spins happen. So uh, we all know that you know you can get clumps of, of results in you know reds or blacks or on a particular dozen or on a particular column. So what we're trying to do is to basically follow the results and hopefully take advantage of those those natural patterns. So uh, what we do here, we just do a single spin and we'll see what number comes up. Okay, so it's on it's column A. So what we're going to do here, we're betting on the columns. So we're going to consider this to be column A. Uh, the 2 to 35 is going to be column B. And the 3 to 36 is going to be column C. Okay, just for shorthand. Now, if um, the result, if our winning number comes on, comes on column C, then that will be our bet for the next time. If it comes on column B, then that will be our bet for the next time. If it comes on column A, it depends whether <coughs> the result is a black or a red. If it's a black, then our next bet will be on column B, because column B has more blacks than reds. And if the result in column A is a red, then we go to column C, because column C has more reds than blacks. So on our first spin, we've got black four. So what we'll do is we'll bet a single unit now on column B. And if we run that through, uh, so the, the result was column C. Um, so we, we, of course, we lose our bet. But what we'll do is we'll follow that and we'll go to C. Again, a single unit because that is our progression. And level, uh, sorry, and the, the result is on column B. So that's, so that's fine. So we win that. So we'll go back to uh, level one of the system, single unit. And we're going to stick with column C because that was the winning column. Uh, so, okay, this one is B. So we'll follow B, single unit. And column B is one. Excellent. So now we uh, we win. Go back to um, column one of the system. Uh, sorry, <laughs> level one of the system. And it's column B again because column B won. So we just stick with that. And it won again. Now I should say at this point that if um, a zero comes up, then basically you just stick with the same column. You just ignore that bet really um, and stick with the column that you were on on previously. So we'll stick with column B here and spin again no so go to follow it to column c and column c1 so we're doing fine here so we'll stick with that 
it's the first level of our system and right so we, we've got a column a so it was a red red 34 so there are more reds than blacks on c so c is where we're going to go all right this is level uh, two of the system i think and it was still it was column a and still red so we we're going to follow that still so this is level three i think and we've won on level three that's fine so we just stick with c because c1 and move through all right so it was a red so that gives us column b and column b1 so you can see that it is quite straightforward each bet we are basing on the result of the previous bet now on a live table of course it does mean that you're switching your bets around a, a fair bit well even on a computer generated you, you're doing that but it's a little bit more difficult on a on a full table with you know lots of people going on and lots lots of chips flying around so you've you've got to uh, keep concentrating if you like so we'll rebet that and uh, we'll just do another couple of spins just to to show where we're at um so now we go to there and keep going and we won now so we'll, we'll call it a day there so hopefully you'll see that this is quite a straightforward system it, it gives you a long potential session but also actually surprisingly it gives you the potential for some really quite big wins now we simulated this based on a million sessions and the average is about 745 spins for uh, if you're willing to go to level 14 of the system but interestingly the maximum win that you'll get within that is, is about 2,000 units or so so if you're betting 10 bucks a go then that's twenty thousand dollars that you're potentially going to win so not only do you have a long session obviously the entertainment and all the free drinks uh, but potentially you can win quite a quite a decent amount so what do we how do we rate this system well it, it could be a lion uh, it certainly got the potential to that I think though that it's more a wildebeest uh, the reason I say that is because you're having to change your bets on every particular spin uh, and that of course gets quite tiring after after a while you potentially you might make the occasional mistake uh, probably not going to cost you a great deal but nevertheless it's still still a bit fiddly so uh, I think we're going to give this a wildebeest which is still pretty damn good and um, I'm sure that if you want to use it you'll uh, you'll have a lot of lot of fun with it and um, you know do very well so um, like the video then then hit the like button subscribe ring the bell leave comments if you think you've got a better system than this then that's brilliant send it through to us at the address on the uh, foot of the screen and we'll have a look at that and we'll run it through our uh, simulator we'll do a million sessions of it and we'll see how it works out see how it whether it it works if it if it makes money then that's brilliant what we'll do is uh, probably do a, a video on it do a fact sheet give you a name check um, and you can see how your system pans out and we'll of course give it our our rating so will it be a mouse will it be a rabbit who knows so that's it for this particular session come back next time and uh, you'll see more of our top 10 roulette strategies so that's it for now bye now guys <laughs> It's not a gamble.com It's not a gamble It's not a gamble.com It's not a gamble